All right, with Sims, we've got uh, a bunch of really cool summer gloves. For um, for me, it's been quite a uh, important part of um, my fishing arsenal. Now is is wearing a glove. One of the reasons I do it is just uh, sun protection. So having the back of the hands just always covered. The other part of it is I've got used to it, and um, it you know it really feels great holding a rod um, with um, with gloves and um, handling fish as well. So uh, once you kind of get used to wearing them all the time, uh, they're re really easy to fish in. And um, the most important thing is, I think it's beneficial from, from a sun protection point of view and from a fishability point of view. So I'll talk you through this range. Every single one of these gloves is UPF 50 plus. So the rating on there says 50 plus, that's as high as we can print on them. Uh, but actually the tested UPF ratings are a lot higher than that. Um, so, um, so really great sun protection, as good as you can get. Starting um, at the simple side is we have a um, Solarflex uh, no finger glove. It has, um, <coughs> just has an open palm and a really simple structure and these little um, uh, TPU um, uh, coated um, uh, fingers and stripping areas uh, and um, just a nice simple little glove. Uh, all the gloves <coughs> except for the um, big offshore glove have got uh, two domes so you can just clip them together to store them nicely in your bag. And the other thing I'd just show you on these is because they're all lightweight gloves, uh, it's really quite important when you're taking them off um, to handle them nicely, if, if your hands are wet. So what I always tend to do is um, pull from the top of the glove, so don't just um, rip it right beside the seam. Uh, make sure you pull from the top of the glove, loosen it up, and then pull the back of the glove and it'll pop off nicely. But I think really important uh, when you're handling them when they're wet, they can stick to your hands and you don't want to damage a lightweight glove. So that is the no finger glove. Um, it's a lower price point, but it's, it's the simpler glove which covers the back of your hands perfectly. Um, it has quite short um, fingers, so um, if you don't want to have a stripping guard and you want to have your fingers just nice and clear for um, tying knots and, um, and, and uh, you know, um, managing your line, then that's a really great glove. Uh, then next is our um, main sun glove, which is in a couple of different colours. Um, uh, this is the riparian camo, so a really good trout um, fishing camo. And then um, this is um, hex flow steel, so a really nice kind of saltwater colour. Of course, you could trout fish in that and vice versa. Um, so both of these gloves, again, those little domes. And um, so this has still that open palm, but it has... Um, uh, it, it, all, all the fingers are, um, have got an, an isolated finger. The two, um, your index finger and your middle finger, are longer lengths for stripping line over them. And they are also coated with, um, or, or, or just have a little uh, leather pad on there as well. So perfect for stripping line. I find, um, actually this morning I just went out and um, fished um, sinking lines um, for kingfish in the harbour here and um, a, a glove like this is perfect for stripping like a, a really heavy sinking line over because uh, the line won't cut into your hand especially if you do a long day of it. So that's really good. Again UPF uh, coating. Um, this is a nice long fit so it'll fit underneath your shirt. You, what um, you don't want to do is have a, a gap between your shirt and your, your glove which is a, an area where you could um, get sunburnt. And then again, that open palm. The nice thing about that is you've got really good contact with your rod. You can feel your rod uh, nicely. So really great for fly fishing. I also use these soft baiting. Perfect for that. Um, there's been no problem on durability for that style of fishing. Um, and uh, so that is the standard sun gloves. <coughs> we do the same glove. Um, with a um, insect shield bug stopper finish as well. So this is a really great uh, backcountry trout glove. So especially uh, those of you who are fishing um, our South Island rivers where there's loads of um, bugs to um, annoy you and, and make it pretty uncomfortable. So that um, 
uh, will really help kind of keep the insects away and give you a little layer of protection, um, both physically with the glove and with the um, insect shield to keep the bugs off. So same glove as the um, sun glove, but with insect shield, that is our bug stopper glove. Next is the guide glove. So um, this is a <coughs> um, similar pattern and design to the sun glove, but what you've got now is a full leather palm and so um, a lot better for uh, obviously guides who are doing <coughs> you know uh, a lot more kind of um, rigorous work and um, so it's going to be a far more durable glove but um, good for conventional saltwater anglers um, and um, anyone who needs that extra level of durability. The other benefit here is you've got with that full palm uh, it's, it's a little bit um, safer for handling fish so if you've got some fish with um, spikes and um, uh, uh, more aggressive scales then um, uh, this glove will help protect your hand for that so that is the guide glove. Last glove uh, for our summer anglers is this offshore glove so um, a perfect glove for those um, guys jigging and stick baiting so you can um, uh, you've got um, again a leather um, protection over the finger so you can handle um, throwing um, uh, you know um, stick baits and um, cast after cast there's some really good durability here um, and uh, again a leather palm for um, handling fish and durability the next part is I would say it's not really a, a leadering glove for those guys game fishing so you don't have there's no um, kind of cushioning there or compression but a perfect glove for um, you know um, saltwater anglers wanting to um, that level of protection from uh, either braid or monofilament when you're casting or um, or jigging so that is the offshore glove again UPF 50 and um, a really awesome kit so Try out a pair of gloves. I think once you get used to wearing them, um, it does improve your fishing. And the most important thing, it keeps that sun off the back of your hands and uh, keeps your sun safe. So, so give them a go and uh, check out the range in store.